we're seeing a, a woman win a prize that lots of people think that men should have won. Whereas far too often in sports now, we're yeah. seeing men who say they're now women it's taking like, prizes like, off biological. It's like Alex, you keep sort of saying, you see how you like it now. Yeah. <laughs> well, no, what, what I, I think, take so, that point. What I think is so remarkable about this is when women have said, oh, it's not really fair, we don't get paid the same. Oh, it's not really fair, we never get a chance to win these awards. Men are like, oh, you toxic feminist, look at you. You are so anti-male, you're a misandrist, you're awful. Blah, blah, blah. The minute a woman, you know, something's been won by women three times in a row, Limon egg, men get prickly about yeah, it, don't they? But the problem we do have here is when you don't have a meritocracy, when things are being done for tokenistic value alone, then when a women, woman does deserve something, this whole debate ensues. We don't get to just enjoy it and keep it. By the way, uh, on uh, social media, the, the viewers of the, this program, uh, BBC Sports Personality of the Year, descended on it. They were furious. Uh, partly uh, because it was always a huge event on a Sunday night. It used to be like at the 